Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Pasha Zinchenko and here with me today is a women's head lacrosse coach, Monica Scott. Thanks for coming out. Of course, thanks for having me. So, Monica, this is your second season as a lacrosse head coach and uh, tell me more about your previous season, you know, what happened, what, what did you do? Yeah, um, last season was, was pretty wild. I came in in the middle of the academic year, um, so suddenly the girls had a new coach, new head coach. Um, I had never met them and we came right into season. Mm -hmm. Um, there were a lot of hardships that we faced, but uh, ultimately we came out on top and ended up 7-7, seven seven, the best record we've ever had. So it was, it was a great season. That's great, that's great. So uh, I know that you have some new players, some fresh recruits. Uh, tell me a little bit more about uh, them. Yeah, absolutely. So we have four new players. Um, Emma Powell from Florida, she's mm -hmm. stepping in as goal. Um, she's really trans translating into a collegiate level really well already. So I'm really excited to see what she can do this season. Um, Hannah Hernandez, also out of Florida, very versatile player. Uh, Kat Aguilar, um, again, super strong, super versatile. And then Ilya Marianich, um, one of the fastest footwork I've seen. So it's a great group, great, great group of girls. That's great. So as a coach, what are the things that you personally are looking forward to this spring? Um, I'm looking forward to finally having some uh, consistency with this team. Um, we've had uh, a new coach three years in a row now, so finally I've been here for a full year. Um, we can kind of put into effect all the things I've implemented. So for the first time ever, we're seeing some consistency and stability um, from top to bottom. So it's going to be really exciting to see that play out. That's, good. That's great. And uh, as I said earlier, you're entering your second season. You're getting more familiar with the competition. Maybe you can tell me about uh, your opponents. Absolutely. Um, you know, Conference Carolinas is super competitive. We've got some top programs in the nation uh, that we face every year. Um, so that'll be really challenging, but also really exciting to see us kind of match up. Um, and then outside of that, we'll, we'll be playing some new programs, um, a team out of Colorado, a team from Ohio. So um, Emmanuel's going to see some exposure from around the, around the country. It's really exciting. Get a name out there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so uh, for all the Emmanuel fans, uh, maybe there's something that we should look out for, some special events or maybe some uh, special players. Yeah, um, absolutely. I think uh, the first thing that comes to mind is senior night. It'll be uh, Wednesday, April 13th at 6 mm -hmm. o'clock. Um, these seniors are the founding members of the team. So this will be the first uh, four-year graduate um, class, uh, or I guess four years of playing lacrosse manual graduating class. So um, we have a lot to honor for them that night. Um, mm -hmm. Definitely encourage everybody to come out for that. And yeah, all three seniors, Savannah Gratz, Haley Larson, and Katie McCall, I mean, they've put in their blood, sweat, and tears to get this program going, so. I'm going to try my hardest to be yeah, there. Thank you. And uh, so the last question is maybe you want to add something uh, from your perspective? Um, yeah, you know, again, I came into this last year um, at a crazy time, you know, we jumped right into, into the season. Um, so this year, I really encourage the Emanuel uh, staff, faculty, students, um, community, everybody just come out and support us because we're really headed in the right direction and it's going to be really exciting to see, um, to see that unfold. All right, thank you for coming out. Thank uh, you. It was a great pleasure having you here. Yes, thanks.